ever had an ATM abruptly devour your hard-earned cash? Don't panic. Let's dive into what steps you can take if you find yourself in this frustrating situation. Number one, what to do if an ATM eats your cash. So picture this, you've just inserted your cash into the ATM, waiting for the satisfying hum of the machine as it counts your money, but suddenly, nothing. The ATM has gobbled up your funds without a trace. Your first instinct might be to curse the machine, but hold on. The best course of action is to file a complaint. This is crucial. Start by contacting the customer service of your bank. They'll likely have a 24-hour helpline for such incidents. Explain what happened, and they will guide you through the process of lodging a complaint. Now, what if you're struggling to get your funds back? This is where the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau CFPB comes into play. Think of them as the ATM troubleshooters. They can help by acting as a mediator between you and your bank. By filing a complaint with the CFPB, they can connect with your bank on your behalf, pushing them to provide a direct response and hopefully resolve the issue promptly. Remember, persistence is key when it comes to reclaiming your money. Number two, how do I get my money back from a failed ATM? So, you've called the bank's customer service, explained the situation, and now you're left wondering, how do I actually get my money back? The process can be nerve-wracking, but don't worry, it's not as complex as it seems. After you've made your complaint and recorded your transaction reference number, this is crucial for tracking. The bank's executive will register your issue and provide you with a complaint tracking number. This number is your golden ticket to getting your funds returned. What happens next? Well, the bank will investigate. They'll delve into the transaction records, checking if there was indeed an error on the ATM's part. This investigation can take some time, so patience is necessary. During this period, keep a close eye on your account statements. If the bank finds in your favor, they'll credit the amount back to your account. However, if the investigation reveals that the transaction was successful, they'll provide you with evidence to support this. Regardless of the outcome, stay in touch with your bank for updates and clarification. Now that you've watched this video this far, I want to inform you that we are giving away a free $100 to one of you, our viewers, when we reach a thousand subscribers. Subscribe to stand a chance to win. And as always, thanks for watching.